Get used to it. <laughs> All right, you go to the It's fairly well known in the place I call home. I like girls with an ass that is roomy. <laughs> I met an old slut with a very large butt. She said, son, for ten bucks you can do me. <laughs> The bathroom wall said that she gave some good head and for a good time to call her this evening. I was worried though that I just didn't know if I'd wind up with some dude named Steven. I gave her a call and we went to the mall and we enjoyed a couple of Slurpees. Was two days or more, I was pretty damn sore. I found out the old bag gave me her beads. Her hair was dyed, she didn't have a good side. She had moved here from someplace near Boston. When I got her home and she took off her clothes, well, my cookies, I just about tossed them. <laughs> Her bush, when she turned, looked like an overgrown fern in desperate need of some water. Her elbows and knees had some scabby disease, and her mustache looked like Sergeant Slaughter. I turned off the lights, cause if I looked at her right, I felt like my eyes would start failing. Then I ran outside as my lunch began to slide, and I vomited over the railing. I went back inside to finish my ride, saying, Betty, it's been good to know you. She said, not so fast, bro, there's something you should know. Now come here, I've got something to show you. The skin looked all wrong right up next to her thong. It was red and it looked irritated. <laughs> Felt an itch on my crank and then my heart just sank. Aw, oh, damn, I should have just masturbated. <laughs> Does anyone know where the love of God goes when you pee and it feels just like acid? <laughs> It was two weeks ago that I slept with that hoe And my penis, now it just stays flaccid <laughs> You might like this song and you might sing along And you may even think that it's funny But you wouldn't know if every time you go There's a discharge that's white and real funny <laughs> My tail now spans all across this great land, from Maine all the way to the Rockies. Give me a sec. My pee now steams like a cappuccino machine, and it keeps burning holes in my jockey. That filthy old hoe lives in Detroit, they say, and it's doubtful that anyone's caring. Her career high, she banged 29 guys on the hood of her Chrysler LeBaron. <laughs> the doctors all say that smell won't go away, like some shrimp that's been shipped here from China. I tried Listerine, even used Listerine, but my nuts still smell like filthy vaginas. <laughs>